this is just going to be another, just another rant, I guess. Testing things out. I wasn't going to do another one of these, but I can't sleep. And I noticed while looking over the footage that there was a bit of competition between me and the actual in-game voices. So, yeah, I guess you guys are getting another one of these. But few you that are actually here, mind you, but... I appreciate the company. I swear, these load times get really bad at some times of the day. I really don't understand why it is. I do love me these load screens though, they look so cool. Got a nice good view of the card art. Yeah, the card art in this is absolutely beautiful. Nothing like a dwarf to get you a dirty spot. Let's see, let's see, uh Silvers aren't quite as valuable when you're running. The Dwarf King guy. That being said, I have four in my opening hand, so... Let's see how this goes. Alright, whenever I play this guy first, I get killed by the one Witcher card. So, uh, I think this prevents it. I'm not sure offhand. I'm surprised that this is still a card. It seems really powerful considering it's more or less a uh, dwarven equivalent to uh, Northern Realm heroes. Called heroes? I'm not sure. Not called flopping. Playing that offhand, he's uh, probably capable of summoning a whole bunch of guys in one turn. At least that's how I usually see these things. I don't know. Oh dear. What you got for? Oh right. That ain't good. No, no, it ain't. Yuvith will guide us. Eh. Second one game that I was on, I guess he's worth the lock. I do like this portrait. I want to get this portrait. The, uh, the border. Not, not the border, just the border. It's so over the top and garish. Makes it perfect. I hope he's got an Igni he's playing it now. That'd be a wonderful a waste. A I got him trained. Oh, that's right, because he locked it, loses resilience. Oh dear. I've got two advantage, that's worth a unicorn. I think. Maybe. This is cool seeing uh, catapults instead of just copious amounts of bodies. I wanted to build a deck like this when I first uh, tried it out because a uh, single player they had a, uh, not this guy, but the one that summons three when you 
just all the duplicates in your deck. You summon them. I had a catapult based one, I thought that was the coolest thing. So it's real cool seeing something like this actually in practice. Still less removal than Nilfgaard. What a, a surprise. You one of us or not? Yeah, alright. Now that you've expended all those resources, I'll let you take this round. This guy will still be around. It'll be beautiful. This is an incredibly loose and terrible way of deciding how to make a deck. But I kind of want to make a deck with seven dwarves in it specifically so I can call it Snow White. Don't know if that's a reasonable decision to be making, but it's something that I thought about. Hey, all right, all right. Ooh. Well, if I got yen, do I need a rag? Eh. It looks pretty, at least. Let's just hope he doesn't have any of the knights that uh, benefit from no armor. Salutations. There'll be nothing to pick up when I'm done with you. Oh yeah, that's right. This deck doesn't run Roach, does it? Ah, I like Roach. Probably hoping that I'm gonna shoot this, which would protect it. Of course, I do have Ard. Let's just throw this down and see. Probably not a very good move, admittedly, but at least I can kill this. It's casual anyway, it's not like it matters all that much. Another one. 
Oh, no, that's a different guy. That new. His art looks familiar. No, I've definitely seen the art before. Maybe it's reworked. Eh, this was close. Okay, no, it wasn't. Yeah, playing the yard there was definitely the wrong decision. Ah well. This step was actually one from the previous format that's actually sort of held up. I'm not confident it's actually worth playing at this point, but... Wait, no, not this one, isn't that? I got rid of the old one. Wait, no, this is a... Wait, is it? I don't know. Let's find out. The ones I had available at this point for the uh, position movement base Scoyotel deck I was trying to get working uh, should probably be out at this point. If they're not, then they will be soon. And it didn't work out so well. I was trying to make it work, but the problem is it's just once you actually get the gears turning, you really don't have a secondary plan. It needs a bit more punch in. You know, you only got the one turn where it actually works, and you need to win two, so... I don't know, I think that uh, archetype needs something, or maybe I'm just not building it right. Both are definitely a distinct possibility, but uh, we'll see, we shall see. would absolutely love to see someone messing around with that, though. problem, I figure, is that it could potentially make weather really strong. And weather was really strong when it, this first came out, when I first uh, joined in with the Gwent, so I don't know if they want that necessarily. I like the positions in, although it kind of takes a moment to get used to it. My folk have suffered much. Okay, let's take a this hand. I'm playing against Dagon, so I'll hold on to these. Okay, yeah, I think this is the old deck. Let this is alright. I do like how they show up once you're done mulliganging now as opposed to daring it. It's kind of impolite of them to interrupt me. What did you eat? Oh! That's a neat way of going about it. I'm surprised to see anyone still running Foggly. I'm not entirely sure it's even worth it at the moment. It certainly became a... Big ol' wall of text reminded me of a Yu-Gi-Oh card. I don't know if anyone around watching this has played Yu-Gi-Oh, but uh... It got pretty ridiculous after a while. And there's a good reason for it, it's because it was things originally in Japanese, so... Uh, it got kinda... overcomplicated. Just because the translation was kinda awkward. That's just how it was. I don't know how smooth it was in Japanese, I mean, just what I've been told when it comes to regards to being a big old text wall. This is Elven Land, Dwan, upon which your kind dies. I haven't played The Witcher, but these Elven guys seem really upset with everyone else. I guess that's a standard feature of uh, people being around, but... I don't know, 
Well, these guys in particular seem to just have problems with humans overall. Uh, maybe I should play one of them one of these days, find out why that is. Or maybe I could read one of the books. I wonder how good the translation is. I know that some uh, translations are kind of rough, but uh, I don't know what the Witcher series. Here they're making a, like a Netflix thing too. I shall not fail. Of course, uh, they were doing a Death Note Netflix thing, and from the last I heard, that wasn't going all that well. So who knows? Gonna be a really good car next. Why have you summoned me? Now we will see who is weak. I kind of like this guy. It kind of sounds like he's singing. Got music in his soul. A tune in his heart. Now we will see who is weak. And a bendy sword in his hand. I like to imagine that the instead of using a sword like the sword he's using like a sling, which is why it's all ranged. Nonsensical, I know, but eh, it's fun to imagine. You best yield now. Here comes the unicorn thing. Oh, wow, well, he's still got value over right? Guess we'll see how long that lasts. What's this one do? I didn't like this one. I wasn't sure what the proper utility of it was, although it is a bit of a stat stick. Potentially. I guess you'd uh, run it if you just see a lot of Skellig, to be honest. Oh, wait. Oh, man, I forgot to... Whoops. Yeah, that... I don't play this one too often. I'm not confident it's very good. But when I make a mistake like that, I really don't have much case, do I? We'll see how this turns out. Too fast for you, Dwan. Ooh, I don't want that right now. Do I? That'd be twelve point eh. Go for it. Why not I kill this thing though? Then I'll be in there and then I don't know. We do what must be done. Yeah, great power you got there. Let's see how this put Ooh boy. Yeah, that's game. Cunning play. Not playing your birdies out front. That's brave. Ooh, master. Is 
that competitive deck he's running. I, I guess mine are, but I'm really low tier, so I don't know. But that casual seems kind of... Eh, whatever. It's not a big deal. Just feel uh, he's right to do so. My men know the meaning of sacrifice. Nat's Thai cell may tower. Goodbye, Roach. Goodbye, Harpy. Hey, not bad, not bad at all. Let's see what we get. Eh, it's not the highest boost, but spiders are scary. Maybe not as scary as they used to be, but yeah, still scary. If it hit the one that had a off to the front again. lock, but hey, what can you do? Wow, I thought my heartbeat thing was mean. Every time, I swear. My men know the meaning of sacrifice. Do as you ask this time. You're kidding me. Might as well just have a golden scorch. I kind of like that one with your card. deal with this right now. Let's see what happens. See my whole hand pulls out a bigger setup than my gold with the double harpies and outvalues me too. I don't like these guys. I don't like any of their archetypes. Maybe it's just me not um, fully recognizing that a lot of it's just that. It's one of the big things when I joined in on this, but I never did care for mechanics where you could see your opponent's hand. To be honest, it's part of the reason why I started running these monsters was just because you have the ability to eat the spies. It was really useful at the time. It's still kind of useful, but at the same time when they're pulling things like this, I'm not entirely confident that's the biggest problem. Is that his roach or my roach? That was just his roach. 
Oh well. Like seriously. That is straight up a Yukio card. Order will triumph. It must triumph. I feel like I should be playing uh Brave Keepers. Just to pin this guy down. Sure. No problem. How can I help? I've had so many people forfeit on me that in my mind they're winning heavily. This was not one of those cases, mind you, but I don't get it. I've probably done the same thing in the same scenario. Alright, this one's dragging along a little much, so... I'll just show the decks I got here. You guys have probably already seen them. I like to flick through them in these. And then I'll end this one. Got a bad habit of deleting some of these when I get frustrated with them when I'm testing. Makes testing kind of difficult. This one's actually changed a decent bit since I first uh, started recording, like, I'm pretty sure we didn't have this or this. And I think I showed... Okay, yeah, uh, this is the, uh, this is the old deck. I got rid of the new deck. This is actually based off one that I was originally playing when I first got into the game. Sad to say I haven't played any of Witcher games, so I really only have, uh, as a point of reference, things from other series. And I think Dwarves, I think Warcraft Dwarves. A bit ironic given that I came from Hearthstone, but... Well, I guess it's iron, that would be the reason, but... Yeah, whatever you get what I'm trying to say, I guess. If not, it doesn't matter. It's just kind of ramblings at midnight. But yeah, Weather Beast was a failure. I uh, didn't much care for these uh, position change elves. Uh, shuffle, I think I called it. Still kind of messing around. I've made all of these just kind of since the format started. It's not that many, but it's what I've got. I want to make a... I'm really not sure what else to make. I don't like the way the Northern Realms or Nilfgaard play. I think the catapults are cool, but I don't really care for the uh, just constant stacking up like that. Because it feels like monsters, but without all the safety. And then they have the occasional edge where it's like, oh, you play weather and then, you know, you win. And that does, doesn't seem very interesting to me. And they all have some kind of archetype undergone that just hasn't really kicked off yet. Probably doesn't have the right cards or something. Like, I'm pretty sure all of them have something to do with recycling your special cards. They call them in this. The spell cards. Of course, they're not spells, apparently, because that's its own category within special, but whatever. I don't like looking up uh, net decks or anything like that, so I'll have to play around with this a bit. Maybe draw a reference from things I've seen, but I don't know. If you have an idea for kind of some kind of deck that you want to see me trying out in the uh, near future, feel free to leave a comment with that. I, I'm always looking for excuses to make something. Yeah, if nothing else, this is edging on 30 minutes now, so sorry, thank you for your time.